hello, it's Sarah again, and I'm going to do a water change on my 29 gallon. I just did a, an API test, and I have some nitrites. I always get them mixed up. I'm going to take pro approximately four and a half gallons. I have this big Home Depot bucket, which is a five gallon bucket. I have a siphon hose thing. I have a bigger one of these, but I like to use the littler one because I can get in between the stuff if I see any like detritus on the bottom of the tank. And um, let's get started. I already took the lid off. That's all I've done is taken the lid off. So the first thing I have to do is they come with this little clip on thing that goes on the side of the bucket. So this will hold the other end of the hose in the bucket so you don't get any problems like that. So I have one end of the hose going into the bucket and here's the other end and I'm just going to take this little squeegee. Let me turn the... This is not ideal but that's, this is all you do. I'm just going to stick this in here and pump it a few times. Hopefully you can see. Here we go. It's starting. Make sure you don't suck any fish up. And there we go. The water is flowing, but look how that beta comes right up. She's so cute. So, I am just going to take this, and I see a little blackness over here on the sand. I don't know what it is. It's probably a snail. The tank is clean because, I mean, I basically just did this last night. I might move, I think there's some stuff over here because I did move that um, amethyst. Yeah, I'm getting some good gunk. I'm back there. I think I'll move that. I'm just going to hold, ooh, my tray is falling. I'm going to try and move this amethyst out of the way. See all that debris? Oh dear, it's falling on my plants. I probably shouldn't do this on camera. It takes a little bit of focus. But I am, that's mostly sand. But that'll fall out. That'll fall back out of the I just let it, let it shake out. And then um, there's my nearite snail back there. I don't know if you can see him. He's on the back of the glass. I'm going to just prop this on top of this rock so that I don't accidentally suck up a fish because I want to put back this amethyst that I just dumped. I don't even know. This is heavy. It's like a heavy rock. Okay, I think we're good. And this is it. I mean, I just stand here. If I see any obvious, like, messes or old food, I'll try to suck that up because that way it doesn't um, biodegrade, you know, or become ammonia. So it's great to do water changes, and this takes really quick. It is not hard. I just got that little leaf. Um, I mean, I have a piece of uh, plant up in my things so my water might be blocked. But see look, I just got a little bit of food. I don't know if you can see that going up the... My plant, my Anubias is coming unattached from its rock. I might have to re-glue it. But I'm just going to keep an eye on the bucket and when that's just about at five gallons, it, I usually don't let it go all the way to the top. And what's happening is I am dilute, I'm going to be diluting the water. 
So when I put the fresh water in, nine chlorinated water, it will dilute the water that's already in the tank to be the appropriate amount of uh, nitrate. And every, I'm not stressing anybody out. I'm just trying to be as calm as I can be. There's a little mess over here I'm just going to get. My crypts, I have crypts, that's a type of plant. They, they're not doing the best. Like, I, they definitely um, are not, like they're dying back. They call it melting. They melt back. I'm just keeping an eye on my bucket because I don't want to, that's a snail. I keep bumping into the tree. I'm just about, and I could have turned off my filter, but I don't go below the, there is a minimum line on my filter, but I don't go below it. I mean, it, it probably is, I should probably be turning off my filter, but I don't. I haven't, because I haven't done that large of a water change yet. I've only done this. So you can see the level. It's like, what would you say? That's like a fifth, right? Like 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. It's a 30. I don't know. <laughs> it's a so it's not a fifth. Ooh, I got to keep my eye on those fish. Those touches are very little and they could get sucked up in my suction hose. All right. I think I'm going to stop. So... I have a, a tray on the ground that I'm just going to pull this hose and I kind of wind it up and then I lay it in this tray. I have this scrubby thing. It's like a little um, green like scrubby thing and I just saw a little bit of algae down here. I don't really get too crazy about it but I saw something right on the front. That's it. I just happened to see that. Because like I said, I did just do this yesterday. So it's not really dirty. And then the other thing was, I'm just going to make sure the tree, let's see, I think it's where I put it. See that red plant up there? That got pulled out. But I think it was probably broken. Let me see. See, this is a root. There's like a big root. I think I'm going to stick that back under. I just love this plant. It's red. I'm going to try and stick that back under the, uh, the sand. And I'm just going to make sure my tree is kind of where I want it. Most of these plants are new. Like I said, I only had this tank for since July 17th, so just over a month. So they're not really established like the roots. But I think that's it. I'm just going to um, dump this. Well, I'll have my hubby. No, I've been dumping it out the front. Uh, just going to move it. And in here, there's just, it's a lot of detritus, they call it. And what I do is I take a gallon I don't know what you call it <laughs> jug and I just take and I make like about five trips to the sink I try to warm the water up to the temperature of the tank which is about 79 to 80 degrees and so that I don't shock the fish and that's it that's a water change so I hope that was helpful. It's very simple. It doesn't take long. And after that, I'm all done for the day. And uh, hopefully my nitrites will come down. 
and we'll just have nitrate and then the cycle will be back in good order. All right, you guys, that was it. Thanks for watching.